Hey, I'm going to quickly show a example of a practical use for um, my new infusion called Evil Portal. Um, if you don't know what it is, check out my last video, and that shows you how to set it up and all that stuff. Um, this is version 1.1, if I might add, so if you haven't upgraded yet, it'll look a little bit different. So let's go ahead and open it up. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to show you my code here, and I'm going to tell you what's going on, and um, yeah. Alright, so basically what I'm trying to do is I'm doing a uh, attack on my captive portal using browser auto opponent and metasploit and I already have that server running here. I'll go ahead and show you my options really quickly. If you don't know how to use metasploit, I'm not going to go over it. You um, should learn that before you try to do this. Um, but yeah, there's my options. The server's already running. Um, and let's go ahead and minimize that. Alright, so I need my victim to be over at the captive portal for, for a little bit so that the exploit can go ahead and run and um, they can be attacked. So I have this JavaScript that runs, and it basically says um, for the first couple of seconds we're going to show this right here, which is just going to say, hey, here's the terms of service, whatever. And then after a couple of seconds, it will allow them to enter. And um, that's done here. And I'll go ahead and show you what that looks like first, and then I'll uncomment my iframe. So over here in this tab, I'm going to go ahead and refresh. And as you can see, it says terms of service, and then you have to wait a couple of seconds, and it'll say enter. And we're going to wait. And we're still going to wait. And, oh, there it is. Cool. And now you can enter just like you normally would. So, yeah, so that's that. And uh, let's go ahead and uncomment this line. Alright, and save the changes. And as you can see, it's saved. Alright, and now let's go ahead and go to our Windows machine. Um, I'm going to go ahead and make that full screen. Um, here we go. So this is going to be the victim machine, and you should see me getting a shell over here. So let's go ahead and open up Internet Explorer, and I get the captive portal, and as you can see back here, a lot of stuff is running. Uh, this is very ugly, obviously. Um, but yeah, whatever your attack will look like, I'm sure it won't look this ugly. I'm just going to click OK to everything. And I'm going to have a shell couple of seconds and it's migrating and boom successful and as you can see over here in Explorer crashed um, but over here if I run sessions I have a session so let's go ahead and attach oh whoops there we go and now I can do a di oh ls yeah there we go and um, let's go ahead and execute um, Notepad.exe, just so you can see that it's compromised. And there we go, it's compromised. Um, so, yeah, thanks for watching. This is just a practical use video for using um, Evil Portal. And I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I can't wait to see what everyone else does. Thanks.